a close call for a trail runner along Mount Tipanogos yesterday when a mountain goat got a little too close for comfort, or maybe he got a little too close for comfort. But this man's video, it's the video of the day, but it's also a good reminder to us all as we start heading into the mountains this summer, keep your distance from wildlife. New at six, Central Utah specialist Sam Penrod shows us more along the trail. You know, seeing wildlife from a distance only enhances our time out on the trail. And while some wildlife may seem approachable, experts are cautioning us to keep our distance. This is video Kevin Slider shot just as the sun was rising yesterday morning on Mount Timpanogos. A mountain goat curiously and slowly approaching him on the trail. And I see him up there all the time. And so I thought, well, I'll just get some video of them. And Slider, who is training for an upcoming Spartan race competition, wasn't nervous at first for what seemed to be a rare close-up look at nature. But the goat suddenly became nope. aggressive. Nope. I, there was nowhere I could go. I was in the middle of a snowfield. Nope. Um, nothing to defend myself with. He was just solid muscle. Nope. I thought, man, if he if he gets me on the ground, I'm. I could be a dead man. You know, wildlife is unpredictable. I think that's the important thing to remember. Scott Root with the Division of Wildlife Resources says in this no. case, Slider appeared to do everything right when the goat became aggressive. There was nothing there in this footage, nowhere for him to hide, to get behind, which typically you'd want to do with big game. So making the noise is what was the best thing he could have done. Root says while people typically stay far away from predators like bears, people do at times approach big game animals which appear to be tame, but warns moose in particular can be among the most dangerous animals you may encounter on the trail. Usain Bolt, he's the fastest man on earth. He could run up to 28 miles per hour. A moose could run 35 miles per hour. Everybody wants to get that photo for Facebook or, or Instagram, but bottom line, get a bigger lens and give the wildlife their, their distance. Yep. While mountain goat attacks are rare, a woman's dog was attacked by a goat on Tipanogos three years ago. And in 2010 in Washington state, a hiker was killed in a national park. For some tips on how you can stay safe in the great outdoors, visit wildawareutah.org. Sam Penrod, KSL 5 News.